Collecting Personal Power Part 2 Greater is spirit within you than you are in the world. When you follow spirit, nothing can be against you, not any principality, not any power. So when we are polarized by ego or the matrix, we're not allowing spirit to control us, which makes us powerless and weak. So how do you make sure that you are following spirit? While you follow divine order, you follow witnesses and signs and symbology. It's a real um, schooling of divination, of looking at nature, of looking at each other, of looking at numbers, numerology, and symbology. I teach this a lot in the art of seeing. But outside of that, spirit has shown me many things to collect person up personal power. Number one, sun gaze with your eyes closed. I always say, I love you so much. Thank you for loving me back. I create, make my body a generator. Your body is a temple of God. So you must fill it with light and you must feed it, feed spirit, light, and frequency. So I use 963 hertz sound in my bath and I often hold crystals. I obey spirit when it comes to food. I drink clean spring water. I actually put my spring water um, with crystals and I activate my water with 963 hertz and I magnetize my water. And you walk outside with your feet, bare feet, and there's many things to do. You can go underwater, uh, underwater frequencies, radio waves, microwaves, pheromones, hormones, telepathy, and entities seem to not be able to affect you underwater, so take a bath and go underwater and stay underwater for a little while. It will help to neutralize and keep things off of you um, and keep your frequency um, th to that of a godlike frequency. So um, there, there's a lot of things that you can do. You can also read a book, and reading books that have images, like a story, helps to train your neurological pathways. So for instance, you read a book like Dorothy and she walks a yellow brick road and she sees a castle and she goes over a rainbow. All of these images speak to your mind. And so reading a book that has life energy will help to transform your mind. Okay, um, the other thing that you can do is put a fresh leaf over your navel or on your back as protection. When the leaf dies, throw it away and get another fresh leaf and put it over energy places where you feel pain. <clears throat> salt. Salt is a crystal and you can put salt, Himalayan sea salt or any kind of salt around your bed, around your doors, in your car as a form of raising the frequency and protection. I'll do a part three.